Oh boy, we haven't done an update on this coaster in quite some time. We've put the raindrops on your lens, you know, just to uh, give you the water feel. But uh, I think it's time we clean those raindrops off. <sighs> Hello there guys, my name is Coach Chell and welcome to this news update. Now today, we're going to be talking about the latest construction on Abyssus. That sounds like a really dark name. At Energylandia, part of their new Aqualantis themed section. Now that's a bit more of a lighter name. Abyssus is a brand new Vacoma roller coaster set to open in 2020. But I mean, judging by COVID, it probably will open in 2021 instead. But from the latest construction, maybe that's not the case. We're going to talk about the latest construction. We're going to share with you an image on your screen along with some other images and concepts from the coaster itself and we're going to share with you my thoughts on the latest construction so without further ado let's get straight into this so before we get started we have massive 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 shout outs to brian galeas falco flair mensis unius and samuel claiborne thank you so much for subscribing to the channel if you want a shout out then please send them in in the comment section below so on facebook prestigio art architectura di Corania, that's pronounced in Polish, has released a picture over the last week with the brand new entrance sign for the brand new Abyssus roller coaster being put in. Now, as well as this recently over the last week, we've had the last part of the train of the ride being put into place, ready for testing to begin. So it's pretty clear the track layout's been completed and the trains are ready to be arriving on track. And they're pretty much on track and they're ready for testing. Now, for those of you who need a little bit more details about this coaster, this is a Vacoma Shockwave roller coaster. It's technically a 1,320 meter model. So this model is the only one of its kind in that model form. However, there is a shorter model, which is the 1,095 meter model, which is being constructed in Jiangsu, China at Dragon Valley Theme Park. Now this coaster has a length of 4,317.6 feet of track, a height of 126.3 feet, it has a speed of 62.1 miles per hour top speed with four inversions, a loop, a batwing and a corkscrew with an LSM launch and an LSM boost. We arrange the trains, three trains with four cars per train. And riders are arranged two across in two rows for a total of 16 riders per train. It has a cost of 11 million euros and the theming was created by a company called Jura Vision Europe BV. Who did the theming for eight other roller coasters. Now their theming all started way back in 2016 when they did the theming for Battle of Jungle King, Crazy Jars, Worm Coaster and Soaring with Dragon all at Hi-Fi Hi Sunak Land. Now the year after they did the theming for Pegasus Express at Park Asterix and Fireball at Furevik. They also did in 2018 Tika Waka at Wolby Belgium and in 2020 they're doing the suspended coaster Eagle Warriors at Win Wonders. Now Vin Wonders in Vietnam has this new Vacoma suspender family coaster called Eagle Warriors which Jurovision Europe BV are doing the theming for. And Abyssus currently is the only 2021 project that is set to be themed around Jurovision Europe BV's creations. So that, my friends, is the latest from Abyssus at Energylandia. Now, in terms of the whole Aqualantis theme section, we've had some news about that. We know that the Disco Coaster has been uh, testing. We know that other, other rides and attractions have been put in. They've been sort of sorting all that out. So... For a 2021 potential project, it's very complete to construction in terms of in the progress. And I think that we're looking here at a very, very detailed, exciting project. So I think we're up to a really good start with 2021. I think we've got some great projects lined up for next year. Uh, this, if it is going to be delayed till 2021, which is pretty much likely to be, then Abyssus definitely will be... Uh, an exciting project for next year. So, Energylandia have really outdone themselves um, for the 2021 season. And obviously, they've got other big projects coming up. The brand new Mine Train. We've got another Family Boomerang coaster. We've got rumours and you know speculation about other future projects like a Tilt coaster going in with the next gen tracks. So, all in all, very exciting stuff from Energylandia. So, 
There we go, guys. Thank you very, very much for watching this construction update on Energylandia's Abyssus and Aqualantis area for 2021. Make sure you give this video a like. Make sure you subscribe to the subscribe button. Make sure you like the like button. Make sure you comment down your thoughts and opinions and your shout outs and your suggestions for down below. And also, guys, make sure you stay tuned for more videos over the next few weeks. I'm Coaster Chow, your channel for factual entertainment. Keep living the coastal life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day. Oh,